Okay, so uh, you guys, I was surprised to learn uh, in doing some research, you, you've never worked together before. That's correct. That's correct. And when I watched this movie... And we never movie, will again. <laughs> <laughs> you guys start as friends, and then your dynamic sort of changes because of extreme circumstances, and then you're essentially trying to kill each other. Um, sure. What's that like? How do you start on one thing and then <laughs> drastically change in the middle of the movie like that? Well... It's a good script. Mm -hmm. All goes back to the writing. If it's in the, if it's in on the page and in on the stage, you know. Yeah, there you go. And uh, so it was in the writing, Brad Ingalls, Inglesby's script, and uh, Ed Harris is a, quite a bit of experience behind him. I have a little bit, so we <laughs> put them both together. Yeah, and, we basically follow the script. You know? Yeah. 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 Um, and uh, there's really no good guys in this movie, for, well, except for maybe Joel Kinnaman's character. But everybody has done some pretty terrible things um so i know that you guys have played you know some really tough roles before like you know tough guy roles um when you sign on to a movie like this are you just like ready if you're prepared to do whatever you have to do violent whatever need be well i mean you know liam's been doing the um taken film so he he's into this kind of he, he knows how to like kill people and stuff and <laughs> not worry about it Sure. You've done I, a few times. I've done a few, time. but not quite, a, you know, not quite to that degree. <laughs> but no, it's, uh, you know, you just get into it. I mean, I, I was very excited to work with Liam because, like you said, we hadn't worked together before, and I've always been a huge admirer of, of his work and his, uh, his humanity, and uh, mm -hmm. so it was fun. Yeah. Um, so, Liam, that's actually a good point. You In the recent years, you sort of, Reinvented yourself, kind of as an as an, a big action star. People like love you as an action guy. I didn't really. It's all a fluke. You know, <laughs> one day you get a script and you think, oh, this would be good to do, and you do it, and you know, people like it. And well, there must be a lot of fun in it, though. Oh, there's a lot of fun. Yeah, yeah. I'm not knocking it at all. My gosh, no. Um, but reinventing myself? No, I'm not really. You know, it's <laughs> yeah. it's. It's, you know, it's a throw of the dice, isn't it? Sure, you know, of course. business. Absolutely. Um, and also, I wanted to ask you, Ed, just sort of clear the air. I know that there's there's a rumor going around the internet right now that um, you actually might be involved in a, uh, a comic book movie called The Suicide Squad. And I was going to give you a chance to clear the air. I haven't heard about that yet. No? No? <laughs> yeah, so no. we can go ahead and debunk that. Yeah. Okay. I, yeah, I mean, it's news to me. Yeah. That would be cool if you did, though. Yeah, it sounds fun. <laughs> I don't know. And uh, Liam, um, uh, have you seen the Star Wars trailer? Uh, no, I haven't. No? No, I didn't know it was out. Yeah, I think you should come back as like a Jedi ghost or something like that. We didn't get enough Qui-Gon the first time around. Do you think so? Yeah, I want well, more Qui-Gon. I, I haven't had any calls, so I'm assuming they've moved on, you know? <laughs> well, gentlemen, I don't want to take up too much of your time. Thank you so much Thanks, for buddy. talking to me today. All right, I appreciate pleasure, it. pleasure, man. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching... Hey, you guys! Hey, you guys, huh? Hey, you guys, Is that yeah. from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey, you guys!